A Day in the Life of an Atlantean Citizen Professions Because all mind beings alive in Atlantis, as well as all others in the Order, besides those who have entered or live in Paradise, are all equally infinite in their potential capacity for telepathic education and learning all there is to know, no one can be said to be smarter or more psychic than anyone else in Atlantis. Everyone knows best what they must in order to be able to survive best through any given situation. All other knowledge is secondary. Having become well-read is irrelevant in a culture based on all knowledge being shared by all individuals equally. The study of Moby Dick or the Bible will not advance you in importance in the ranks of Atlantean society. Because the ability to manifest matter using mind alone is the cornerstone of the Lemurian Church Bank's currency of economy, the method of progressing in importance in such a society is by acquiring the rights to more and more ZPE in order to construct on the largest scale possible the best forms of manifestation to serve the greatest number of living beings. Thus, the only way to fail in such a society is to opt out and choose to not manifest anything positive or beneficial to oneself or others, or worse, to intentionally generate self-destructive matter. Because ZPE is not self-regulating for applying morality to its use, so it falls to others to regulate when a crime has been committed. Because we are all free in heaven to do anything we wish, crimes are allowed to be committed because they can only be punished afterwards. Thus, there are those whose job it is to do good for such a premised society, and those pitted to do evil against it.